Coming up on Bass TV News, see if the remote with Mercy works today. And find out how girls volleyball did against Phoenix Girl. All that and more, so stay tuned. Hello and welcome to Bash TV News for Tuesday, September 24th, Day 2. I'm Kira Comfort. And I'm Hunter Healy. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance, followed by a moment of silence. Attention sophomores, if you need a copy of a fundraiser brochure or class ring information, copies are available in the main office outside of room 204. Fundraising orders are due on Thursday, September 26th, and checks should be made payable to student services. You can also sell the products online. If you have any questions, please email Ms. Gilman. Ninth grade students interested in learning more about the program of studies offered by BCTC, Burke's Career and Technology Center, will have an opportunity to tour both BCTC's Oli and Leesport campus on October 8th for the entire school day. If you do not receive a permission slip, please stop down in the school counseling office to receive one. Permission slips are due by September 26th. Please contact Mrs. Maisie with any questions. Boyertown students, are you interested in joining the national championship award-winning Boyertown TSA club? Bash TSA and Freshman Academy are accepting applications to join one of the most successful clubs at Bash. Joining is simple. Stop in at room 420 and pick up the registration packet. Take it home and get your parents to sign and pay the $45 membership dues. Our opening meeting is October 2nd, 2024, right after school in the LGI Champions from Bash TSA will have the opportunity to travel to Nashville, Tennessee this summer to compete in the 2025 National Championships. The first step is, join, is signing up to join. Let's go to Mercy Appaloosey with some information about t-shirt design. Bash's Impact Club is hosting their TV design competition. The winner will receive free Impact merch and a prize. Posters are located throughout the halls if you're interested. Just scan the QR code and upload the design. Submissions for the TV shirt design closes this Wednesday, September 25th. Contact Ms. Brigiova, Abigail Fretz, Caleb Hook, Liliana Myers for more information. Reporting live from the hallway, this is Mercy Agbalusi. So Derek, I heard we had a pretty big Phillies game last night. Big would be a very, under, very much an understatement. Well, why don't you tell us about it? Well, for the first time in 13 long, treacherous years, the Phillies have won the NL East. <laughs> it, it's just the Braves have won in the last seven years. It was, it's just a lot, like. Uh, this year feels different. I don't know what it is, but like this team has, it, it just feels different. Like I think this is the year. I really think this is the year. Anyway, on to the school sports. Girls soccer lost to Emis 2-1. to one. Girls volleyball beat Phoenixville 3-0. to zero. Girls golf beat Spring Ford 195-209. to 209. And we'd like to congratulate Will Swarley for, who shot a 76 at the Pack Individual Golf Championships, and Chase Dillman, who shot a 72 at the Pack Boys Individual Tournament. That's all for sports. Back to you guys. Attention art students. This is one final plea for you to come pick up your art in the art department from last year. Everything will be discarded by the end of this week. The homecoming dance will be held on Saturday, October 12th from 7 to 10 p.m. in the Bear Gym. Tickets will go on sale the week of September 23rd to 27th during lunch periods. Tickets are $15 and you need your ID at the time of purchase. All obligations must be cleared by Friday, September 20th at 4 p.m. Attention junior and senior girls. The Powder Puff game will be held on Wednesday, October 30th at 7 p.m. with a mandatory practice on Monday, October 28th at 7 p.m. 
Forms can be found on the Student Council website. Deadline to sign up is September 27th. Junior or senior males interested in being a cheerleader or coach can also find the appropriate forms on the Student Council website. If you have any questions, contact Mrs. Musselman or Mr. Pennington for more information. And now let's go to Kaylee for Bash TV News Flash Weather. Like Derek said, 13 long years, but we've finally done it. Way to go, Phillies. All right, let's get into it. Current temperature is 69 degrees with humidity of 73% and a wind speed of 8 miles per hour. 12 p.m. lunch, 65 degrees. 3 p.m. after school, 67 degrees. And 6 p.m. evening, also 67 degrees. Yo. Yo, all right, today we've got a high of 70 with a low of 60. Wednesday, we've got a high of 78 and a low of 52. Thursday, we've got a high of 78 and a low of 59. And Friday, we have a high of 78 and a low of 69, 65. That's all I got, back to you guys. From Derek, Kaylee, and everyone at Bash TV News, I'm Kira Comfort. And I'm Hunter Healy. Have a two have a tubular Tuesday. Tuesday. Yeah. Some turn around and I'll pick up the slide. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. 